Hey guys, and welcome to episode one of The Diary of a Destiny Noob. In this series, I'm going to be talking about all things noob in Destiny, from just how crazy overwhelming this huge MMO is, all the way through to end game material, end game content, clans, raids, playlists, you name it. I'm going to be covering it all in here from the perspective of a noobie noob noob as I experience it all for the first time. So without further ado, let's get into it. Before I forget, please do consider liking and subscribing to my YouTube channel. It would mean the world to me. I am a small YouTube content creator. I love Destiny 2. I stream most weeknights from 11 p.m. UK time. Always happy to play Destiny with new and veteran players. So please like, subscribe, and let's get into the video. So one of the first things that people ask me is why the hell has it taken you so long to play Destiny 2, Mr. Willis? And I'll tell you why. I love MMOs, I always have. My first one, and possibly my greatest love, World of Warcraft. I played that game for 14 years. Not straight, okay, I had a little bit of a life in and around that game, but I played it for around 14 years on and off. And that to me was great. It saw me through university, it saw me through university again, and it saw me through up until very recently, just my life, you know? I loved MMOs, I loved World of Warcraft. I tried New World as well when that came out, I jumped on that bandwagon. Um, and then it was good, I enjoyed that, but when I realized I didn't have about 150 hours to spare just get into the level cap, you know, I haven't got, I haven't got time for that. So I went back to World of Warcraft, because I knew I could just dip in and out, just do some questing, do some of this, do some of that. But then recently, I was thinking, I want to try something new. I've done World of Warcraft for 14 years, okay? That is way too long to be spending in any game, as much as I love World of Warcraft. But I was looking for something new. So I was looking on the Epic Games Store and I found Destiny 2 and the base game for it was free. And I thought, what have I got to lose by just giving it a go? So I downloaded it, gave it a go, jumped in and I thought, holy hell, what the hell is going on here? I had no idea. And I nearly, nearly quit the game right there. So when you start Destiny 2, you have a very, 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 very brief tutorial with your ghost. So he walks you through how to shoot, how to jump, how to breathe, how to use a controller, how to use the keyboard and mouse, just the basic things, just in case you've ever grown up without any form of computer knowledge whatsoever. After that, it basically just says, there you go, you completed the tutorial, here's destiny, go nuts. And then it just leaves you alone. And it's like, right, okay, so what what, what, what do I do now? Just, just do I just, I, I just do destiny, I guess. One of the major things that confused the hell out of me was I I don't know what mission I was doing, I don't know what campaign I was doing, but I logged out and when I logged back in, there was a whole different intro. There was a whole different video scene, a whole different cutscene. There was different characters. There were characters that were dead, and now alive or alive and now dead. I, I don't even know. And I almost quit the game there. That was the point where I almost quit the game because I thought this game has zero structure. How am I supposed to devote my time, my, my, my precious free time, to a game that has zero structure for new players? I, I genuinely had no idea what I was doing. I just jumped in and that was it. It just threw me around. Go here, go here. Here's a cutscene. Here's something else. Here's Witch Queen. Here's Shadow Keep. Here's this, here's that. I, okay, slow down. Slow down. So what I did, I just thought, do you know what? Let's just do it. Let's just have fun. Let's just shoot some stuff. Let's just kill some aliens with some big guns. You know, let's, let's, let's get, let's use explosive arrows to mount enemies in seconds. Let's just do it. Let's have some fun. You know, what's, I haven't paid anything for it. What's the worst that's going to happen? We're just going to, we're just going to, you know, go back to World of Warcraft at some point and reactivate my subscription. So I was doing it. And then at that point, I realized, all right, you know, a few hours later, I was like, okay, okay, I see. This is fun as hell. These guns are awesome. And there was one gun in particular, and I cannot remember the name of it, and I don't know what happened to it. I might have got rid of it. Don't kill me. I think it was a I think it was an exotic. I think it was a trace. It was a trace gun. And basically it just like it, it just folded up. You, you would fire it and it folded up enemies. It just went whoop great sound effect i know but it just went whoop and just folded up the enemy and they just disappeared like into the cosmos at that point i thought wow this is awesome how much fun is it? i've never played a game that not just had weapons like that but also it looked and felt so smooth and so fun and so joyful that i was like do you know what i don't care that i don't know what is going on i don't care 
there. I'm being thrown from campaign to campaign, from planet to planet, from, from playlist to playlist. I don't know what I'm doing, but I do know that I love doing it and I'm having loads of fun doing it as well. So I thought, you know what? Let's just keep going. Let's keep going. So I was having more fun. I had more fun. I was killing more people. I was getting more crazy weapons. I was I was learning the different subclasses and having fun with with being able to swap everything out at a second's notice and just play a completely different uh, different character, different build for a different situation. Not even a different situation. Just if I got bored, switch it up. You know, let's go solar. Let's use those flaming guns. I'm a hunter, by the way. Let's use those flaming guns. You know, it's fantastic. So yeah. That's what I did, that's what I do, and that is why I'm still with Destiny 2. So all in all, it is a crazy complicated game. If you are a new player, and you are thinking, what the hell am I doing? Why am I doing this? What, what is the point? What's the story? What's going on? Who's that guy? Why has he got that? What's this little thing? Follow me around. Why do I always come back? If you've got all of these questions, just ignore them. Just ignore. I did, I still do have these questions. I, while I'm streaming live on, you, on my YouTube channel, I have people come in, some of my regulars when I was playing other games, they come in and they say, what are you playing? I say, I'm playing Destiny 2. And they say, this looks like so much fun, but it looks crazy at the same time. I'm saying, it's free, give it a go. They give it a go, and then a lot of them are like, this is too crazy, I don't know what's going on, this is hurting my brain, it is melting my face, it's giving me a migraine and I can't sleep at night, Mr. Willis, why did you get me to play this? And my advice to them, and is to you, if you're a new player as well, that is experiencing or thinking of experiencing Destiny 2 right now, in 2023, just go with it. It, it doesn't need to make sense. You don't need to know what's going on with the campaign straight away, because you're not going to. It's, it's, it's mad. You're not going to know. And you don't need to know. All you need to know is that you're having fun while doing it. If you're having fun, if you're laughing, if you're looking forward to doing it, if time's flying while you're playing this game, you're on the right game. So my advice to you new players, stick with it. If you're having fun, don't worry about the small things, about the campaign, about the story, about what this is, what that is. Just Google it, or better yet, keep an eye on my channel and I will try and explain everything throughout this series as I'm going, because I'll have the same questions as you and hopefully I'll be able to answer them as well. Also, I do stream live every weeknight on my YouTube channel. I'm streaming Destiny 2. I stream from about 11 p.m. UK time for a few hours, and I'm always happy to play with viewers. So if you want to stop by, please feel free to do so. I'd love to see you, love to chat with you, and I'd love to kill some aliens with you.